for the installation of the pistons you need to use a special uh, spring ring compression tool and the way it works um, you tighten it up on the outside of the piston this here you put it on you tighten it up but you need to oil all the inside surfaces here because there's a lot of friction as you tighten it if it's not oiled it gets really weird and hard to compress the springs correctly so that's a useful tip make sure your tool is oiled on all of the surfaces that slide up against each other because it kind of starts acting like a clutch so next I'm going to put the tool on the piston then I'll use the wooden handle of a hammer to tap it down into the cylinder and you want to really double check and make sure that the front mark of your piston and the front mark on your rod are facing towards the front of the engine where all of the serpentine belts are that turn your alternator and your start your um, alternator and your air conditioner and all of those different pieces so now we'll compress the the rings open this up a little bit and we'll go and install this system number one see how easy that that turns really nice and easy when it's oiled well you oil it really well like that and it just really turns easily what you want to do is have these little tabs on the bottom sticking out just a tiny bit so that you can get it started easily. I just have like half of the tab sticking out like that. Then you tighten it down really good because you want to have those rings flush with the uh, flush with the piston. So now we're going to go over to the car and tap this piston into its cylinder, making sure that it's facing towards the front of the engine. 